Welcome one, welcome all, welcome to another exciting episode of Tales of Heroes Training Tuesdays. Uh, well, Rogers and I couldn't get together this uh, this weekend. We had the opposite schedules, so I, being Bridger, decided to do something solo if I could to try and put something up here for you, even if it's a bit late. So what we're going to do is we're going to play a game, and I am going to try to comment on what's going on. I've tried this a whole bunch of times, and so far they've either been blowouts in one direction or another and haven't been super interesting. So hopefully this one will work. While we're waiting for a game, I wanted to tell you about a, a new method that I have been using uh, for hotkeys. The problem that I have come across is that my left hand sitting on the keyboard, I use grid keys, but my left hand sitting on the keyboard in the normal touch typist position can hit the 1 through 5 keys really easily, and it can hit the 6 key by memory without having to look down at the keyboard. However, 7 through 0 are very difficult for me to hit without looking down at the keyboard because they're considerably farther away from where the left hand usually sits. To alleviate that problem, I realized that my mouse has a ridiculous number of buttons and I don't use them in RTS games. Well, now I do! Because I bound them to 6 through 0. So now I'm using them on my mouse button. Okay, Industrial Riverbed. Panzer Elite versus American. Let's see what we can do with this one. I know that I am going to want to grab a tier 2 strategy. Uh, that's what I've been practicing recently. And it's sort of a general strategy that, that will work on most of the maps in most situations. It's probably the most popular strategy. So I'll show you how I do it, and maybe it'll help your Panzer Elite game, since I heard a lot of people asking for that. So first thing, quickly build your, uh, your unit here. I'm going to get my Kettenkrad working on grabbing a whole bunch of resources. So, one thing that you should remember, always go back to your base at the beginning. Tell them good luck, have fun. And uh, queue up a second Panzer Grenadier as soon as you can. And then you have to remember to watch your resources and go after uh, and, and, and just keep track. As soon as it gets to 255, you should queue up another one. That's quite important. And it's something you should keep track of. So you, what you want to avoid doing is called floating resources. That's when you have more resources than you currently uh, need. Like if the next thing you want to build costs 200 and you have 400, you should have built that, you know, a long time ago. So I'm going to try to avoid that. So I got to keep track here. So this is my two. This is my one because I'm going to put that on him. So I got to remember to... I'm going to send these guys out together to go fight engineers and whatnot. So now I'm going to go back and hit a third. There we go. I avoided floating too many resources. Always remember to upgrade Gewehr 43s on one of your first Grenadier squads here. I'm going to go see if I can't find somebody in this vicinity over here. Hopefully I can uh, double team them and force them to retreat with my Panzer Grenadiers. While... Uh, my Kettenkrad does all the capping. And if I do force him to retreat, I can decap this and force him off the fuel. The Americans with fuel is a very bad deal. There he goes. He's going to cap that right now. And I don't like it. So I'm going to try to stop it. There we go. We got engineers. Putting the Gewehrs at long range because they actually do more damage that way. Now I'm going to go disrupt it. Oh, that jerk. Well, luckily I forgot to move this guy, so now he's going to come and try and save that point. So we've both managed to cut each other off of our fuel. I'm building a fourth here. All right. You guys are going to need to get in the house, because I feel riflemen coming. That is to say, I heard them coming. What is that? Another engineer squad. Okay. Yep, there's the rifleman I was worried about. Let's see if we can shoot at him a little bit from inside the house. Here's number four. Alright, we're going to need some fire to take these guys out. Getting in this house was a good plan because now he's forced off and away. We're recapturing this, we're connecting our fuel, but he's decapping that. That's son of a gun. Alright. And now this is four. 
So far, I have not had to retreat anybody, but this guy is going to retreat as soon as he's done. So that he can build me... Uh-oh. Kettenkrad's bitten attacked here. It's got a burnout. Don't get a bad engine. Go! Go, go, go! Hopefully if they don't follow it, he'll be able to cap something. Alright, throw some fire in there. Have fun with that. Alright, so... They're still chasing me here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's cap this and that. And this, and hopefully the Ketten will be safe. Alright, I think I'm doing okay right now. I need these guys to build me a tier 2 building. Not a tier 1 building. Tier 2. Alright, we did force him away. Excellent. I'm gonna have him cap that and then retreat. You are going to retreat as soon as you're done. I don't want them to be out on their own if I can avoid it. It's a dangerous situation. And I need the Ketten to get repaired. Okay. No reason to fight them with only a squad of two guys. I know they've got riflemen in the middle. I'm getting my infantry half-track here, which will let me reinforce in the field, which is quite important. I'm going to build another... As anytime you have just too many resources, just build more grenadiers. Can't hurt. You go and fix this thing. I'm going to get Gewehrs on another squad here. See if you can't get some shots off there. Fours right there. So now... These guys are now my ones. So the next one coming out will be my twos. This guy's got to be my two. Alright, Ketten's gonna go try to grab this, because he's brought all of his units over here. Now I've got all my units forcing him to retreat. Okay. Managed to disrupt his retreat here, which is good. And we're gonna try to cap as much as we can. Oh boy. That's bad news. He's gonna... He's gonna stop that. I did... He still hasn't taken back his fuel in the north, though. That's very good for me so far. I've got my half-track out. Right to there. We must protect our munitions from enemy advances. Let's move out. Now, you want to be extra careful here. He hasn't upgraded bars. He could be getting an M8 soon, so I have to grab Shreks. That's got to be the next upgrade. I did take my... Dang it, those jerks. And now i got to get some healing, because my guys are real weak. Let's see if we can't push these guys off of this fuel again. That's a four. Hopefully he's not noticing. There we go. Okay, so... Shreks are available as soon as... And I've got plenty of resources, so I'm going to build another Shrek squad to go with it. Uh-oh, they're coming up the middle here. Get behind that. Run away, Kettenkrad, run away! I need this to get here to reinforce these guys. Oh boy. That's going to be a good spot for a grenade. Yes, right into the fire! Oh boy. Uh, 
That's still not fast enough to heal. But wow, he stayed there and lost a lot of dudes. Thank you, Half Track, saving the day. Whew. Wait, how did the car fell over? <laughs> All right. All right, now we've got Shreks. We're ready for him if he does break out. And fours are going to come down here and be ready. Uh oh, he back teched. So maybe I don't need those Shreks, but I'm going to have them anyway. Come on, get inside the half track. Get inside the half track. I just need you to get inside the half track. Now they're inside the half track. There we go. All right, that took a little too long. Ketten's got to come over here and recap this for me. Might be somebody there though. I didn't notice. I just got to watch out for this machine gun here, which if it turns on armor piercing, I'm in big trouble. Actually, you are going to build me tier four, and you are going to build me tier one, so I can get increased squad sizes. So I'm hoping to get MP44s. Oh boy, oh boy. I'm not on the no, the machine gun. Back away. Use your momentum for helping. We are losing a sector. Okay. Let's use this to get here really quick and then we gotta heal it. Forward supply lines are broken. Squad is ready for order. Alright, four, you're gonna come this way. Oh, 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 that was close. Twos are going to come over this way. Good job, Kettenkrad. Let's go harass him over here. i got to keep real close eye on that because it's close to their base. They could do something about it. I need to repair this thing. All right, there we go. So, my three and my four can each upgrade. I'm getting an armored car. We are losing a sector. Oh, jeez, Recoilus. Run away. Abandon thoughts of an armored car. Abandon all thoughts of an armored car. Oh, that's in trouble. Instead, let's get, get large squad sizes. And MP44s. That'll help us a lot. You guys stay over here. We don't need Shreks right now. And retreat. Hey, you guys, don't let this happen. Alright. Uh oh. I didn't do that right. I didn't keep track of it like I said I should. Oh, it's in trouble. All right, after that you retreat, and after that you retreat. I'm using shift commands to send them back to the base as soon as they're done. All right, now I've got larger squads and MP44s on two of my squads, so I'm going to be uh, in pretty good shape here once I can get those airborne down. You should retreat and reinforce. These guys are going to get that up and retreat. I did lose the Ketten Krad, so let's send this guy over here. Threes and fours are going to go support him. The middle is still mine, so I'm hoping to hold on to that. Let's see. Scorched Earth is so much fun, even if <laughs> you don't usually get to use it very well. I'm going to take a, take a chance here. Alright. Alright, you also need to get your... Three and four, get up here. Oh, but they are going to have... Oof, I better get a mortar half-track. They are going to have the machine gun. So what I need to do is try and draw its fire. I'm 
I'm sure they're going to have the machine gun set up over there. You... Get on the other side of the cover. Alright, now we're going to try and move in here with these guys. And these guys are going to try and flank the machine gun if it's up there. Yep, there's a machine gun. I'm going to have both sides try to throw a grenade, and one of them will succeed. Uh, he's just going to be reinforcing over there. That's not a good deal. Here's a mortar. Alright, okay, so far so good. And anybody that's not moving right now should instead be uh, putting booby traps on things. That's what I need next. Oh boy. I need my... Tank Busters is not the correct response here. Wow! Let's send them both over here. Send the mortar down to try and help out. These guys are just sitting here. Booby trap. Our supply lines are broken. We have territory out of supply. Got him. Okay, so we're doing okay right now. I need you guys to keep harassing this side. They can do it by themselves because they are. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! What is hitting them? Oh. Jeez, what is damaged engine? Is there an AT gun back there I was missing? I don't know. Repair this dude and then retreat. Meanwhile, you are going to retreat and we can see what we have back here for reinforcements. I need Martyr coming soon. Even though he back teched, I gotta be careful. Okay, you are then gonna go and take this. I don't have... Ooh, there we go. Give him defensive. Oh, no! Ugh. Grenades against those guys. Terrible. I managed to cut him off from his fuel again. And these guys should be able to do something, especially if I give him some mortar support. You need to come over here and drop a little surprise here. Booby trap. I think I need another Ket and Krad, and I have the resources for it, so I'm going to do it. And uh, I'm also going to grab from my Tier 1 building a scout car that I can use to OP. Jeez, again with the grenades! I wasn't able to dodge that one. I got here too late. Oh no, I can't lose that guy! Oh, he's in trouble. Run faster! Oh, okay, well, I got resources to burn, so let's build another one. That was my number three read dude here. Okay, you come put that there. You put a booby trap here. Ket and Crad, hello, how are you doing? Thank you for coming. Drop it right there. Uh, we got sector artillery. I like it. There's a good number of... Uh, uh-oh, I put them in the wrong place. That's a big problem. He's about to die. I need to get both assault grenadiers over here to take out these guys and dodge grenades. That's the other thing I need to do. Ooh, hello. Not good. Uh, 
you can't do that. Dodge the grenade. Ooh, lost one guy, that's no good. You're gonna go around and flank this machine gun to death. Oh, he's got another machine gun there, son of a bitch. Well, it's time to go. We got a scout car. Push that away. He's gonna retreat. You need to go and get this. We need to take the VPs here. Damn! I missed that over there. I need to get to uh, Panzer IV, I think. It's gotta be my next bet. You are gonna OP this point for me. Run away! Hmm. Alright, so those guys are getting that. You're also gonna go over here. Haha! Have explosions, you jerk. Alright, so far I've been doing decently keeping my units alive. Can I do sector artillery right here? Because I think I should. Yes, I can. Ho oh, ho! Hello, how you doing with the sector artillery there, buddy? Is it is it good times? Have fun with that. All right, so. Oh, I started building that and then stopped. All right, one of you is going to come here. The other one is going to retreat right now and rebuild that. They're finally trying to get their fuel back. I'm going to start building a martyr while I wait, having that in the wings. Get out of there. Come on, you guys can do it. Alright, let's get over here. You, build this. I need the Panzer IV stat. You do it too. Damn machine guns. Alright, I need you to run around here real quick. And then I can hit this machine gun a lot. All I need is this guy to get behind him and throw a grenade on him, and then my fours can come in. There we go. Now you can retreat. Ones and four. The Americans are capturing a sector. Throw a grenade right there. No more machine gun. Alright, and this... Got him. Okay. Do that quick. Send the Martyr up here. Backing them up. Panzer IV being built. I'll try to flank this machine gun this way if he's got one here still. See if he notices my Ketten sneaking around there. It looks like maybe. There it is. He's got an AT gun right in the middle too. That's not. That's not bad. Luckily, I have that. Lost a vehicle. Oh, he had uh, stuff by Ketten. Under enemy 
He's shooting at my base. That's not cool. Alright, Panzer IV coming out. I know he's got an AT gun, but I think I might be able to neutralize that right now. Uh, you are also going to come and try to flank it. And you are going to come and support them. He's got a lot of his anti-infantry stuff over at my base for some reason. So it won't be able to go and save his AT gun when we charge. Everybody charge. Everybody charge. Get up here. Kill it all. Oh, jeez. Good thing I had Shrek guys there. Son of a bitch. Where's my martyr? Martyr! Come on! Take it out! He is attacking my my company deal. I don't like that. Yeah, I know. I know what you did, and I don't care. You see me not caring? A second one? That's not gonna work. Get him. Oh. Can you throw him? They can't throw him. These guys have got to go retreat. We got him on the retreat. Awesome. He's getting repaired. Okay. I'm going to build some more anti-infantry guys here. Shrek's going to get some survival. And he's going to retreat after. I think I hear... I thought I heard tanks coming. Managed to retreat that grenade there. Oh, these guys are going to get tons of kills. There we go. Got some veterancy. You can come and help. Why don't you? These guys are giving their lives out here. Might be time to retreat now. But these guys are in very good shape. Okay. You guys, y'all need to build me another comp group. <laughs> I didn't get all the upgrades yet. I want Panthers. All right. Americans are seizing territory from us. These guys got double defensive. They could last a while here, even with all this fire. As long as they get to the green cover. There it is. Good job, dudes. Where's my Panzer IV? Not finished getting repaired. Panzer Grenadier section is being reinforced. And offensive bet for him. And let's retreat them. Alright, this is done. Let's get advanced repair. Everybody here needs to reinforce. Why can't they reinforce right next to the building there? Not enough resources. Wow, okay. I also have these, I forgot. Scorched. Uh oh. Let's 
Let's stay light, right at max range. Where are you going? Oh, they got shot. Okay. What are you shooting at? There's a guy back there? Oh, shit! He got real close! Oh. Alright, we need to cat and crad as soon as we can. Alright, there we go. They're retreating! Chase them! As long as you're not running straight into an AT gun. You know, like that one right there. There we go. Got another kill. Back off, back off. Full retreat! Alright. These guys are also going to come repair it. Tank buster reinforcements are mustering. <sighs> missing a five. He's still giving me the fuel right now. I could get another Panzer IV if I want. Supply lines are broken. We have territory cut off from supply. Grenadiers here. Position noted. Assault grenadiers moving up onto objective. Ooh. Ah, they took the point on the bottom. There they go. Jerks, I really need a Kettenkrad to help me take these points, and I just can't waste it all the time. Yeah. Alright. This is a horde worth throwing at whatever he's got over here. Because I'm guessing it's not a machine gun. I'm guessing. I think he's scared of my Panzer IV. Which is why he's got an AT gun, but not a machine gun. Alright, Panzer IV can now come up because the AT gun is gone. Uh oh. There is a machine gun after all. We get a grenade there, though. Defensive on everybody. So now, we could grab a machine gun, which I think is going to be quite awesome. What is that? I don't like it. Actually, you guys are both going over there. I've got a Kenton Crab for the dirty work now. Do this and this, and then cut him off again. Cut this. He's cutting my fuel. I'm not a fan of that, so it's time. It's time for the scout car to own, earn its job here. Alright, you need to retreat, you need to come set up right here. I like this. Oh shit, scout car. You did your best, but I think you're in trouble. Yep, one shot, wow. Did I build another Panzer IV? I should have built another Panzer IV. I didn't build another Panzer IV. Ah, booby trap everything, I almost forgot. Ooh, I lost something over here. Jerks. Excellent. Take them all out. Let's ride full speed. Alright. That that worked out okay. I wasn't paying attention, but 
I think it worked out okay. We must injure the enemy and reduce his 300 points. Alright, you can take some offensive vet and run the hell away. The enemy is seizing our territory. You can retreat a little bit, pull them in the machine gun. What do we got back at the base that needs to reinforce him? Oh yeah, let's activate the Panther Battle Group. I think that's time. self-propelled artillery pieces can now be commissioned for our troops. Those are bars, but I can't pick them up. I think those are bars. Oh, they finally got one of my dudes. Oh, we have another Panzer IV. Look at that. Oh, retreat that guy. I need this one to back up the MG here. Alright, you capture the victory point and this. I think I got this one in the bag. I think. I could even get a Hummel. I lost one of my Shrek squads, huh? So sometimes it's not a bad idea to just pressure right into the fog of war if you don't think he's going to be ready. You can maybe meet an AT gun that's on the move instead of uh, running directly into one that is not. Like here we ran into a machine gun. And I'm thinking that he doesn't have any more AT guns. Oh, he does have an AT gun. Whoopsies! He's in trouble here. If I can come into his base and maybe kill infantry that are chilling over here. No, my sticky. Kill the AT gun quick. All things are coming over here. Where's that Hummel? At the extreme range, but it'll do. gonna try to stick in me. All units can come in this side now and things will be okay. <laughs> Their rapid fire ability, so they stay stationary and they shoot faster. Can I add sector artillery here? Ah, because that would be awesome. But no, that doesn't make any sense. Why don't you come right here? You are awesome. Go retreat. Hummel, what are you gonna do for me here? Alright, why don't you drop some sector artillery right here? 
on whatever he's got there. Yes, that's what I was hoping for. Boom, boom, boom. Let's bring another one. Ah, there we go. All right, so that was a fairly good game. Uh, it wasn't uh, it wasn't a complete blowout. I did manage to take a considerable upper hand by the end there. The American player was not fantastic, but uh, it's probably the best game I've had so far in my narration uh, series. And hopefully uh, seeing my maneuvering around the map it will help some new players figure out how they uh, how they can you know best adjust their methods. And I'll try to put a link to grid keys in the description of the video here so that uh, you too can have the awesomeness that are grid keys. In case you didn't know what those are, um, you notice halt is Q, attack move is W, attack ground is E, and if something was here, it would be R. That's for this guy. Let's see if it does it for these guys too. It won't let me click anybody else. But everything that is in this area is Q. Everything that's here is W. Everything that's here is E. Everything that's here is R. Next row down is A, S, D, F. So it follows the, key the keyboard itself. So if you're a touch typist, you don't have to memorize all these obscure, you know, okay, Pioneer is, is, is P, but Engineer is E, even though they're basically the same unit. I have to remember two different units, and P is all the way the frick over there on the other side of the keyboard. Why the hell do I have to stretch my hand over there? I have to look down and blah. I just use grid keys. Now, grid keys have some very small problems. For example, camouflage is normally here, but for some units, it's like down here, and some units, it's over here, so it's always instead considered to be D and S for camouflage and, uh, and don't fire. Uh, but on the whole, you know, 98% of the buttons all work exactly as you'd expect them to, and it certainly helps me compete significantly more. Without them, I don't know what the hell I'd do. Anyway, so the, here's the control groups I had at the end. My Kettencrad was always on zero. That's one of my mouse buttons. I, I, I used my one to put together my two long-ranged units, and... Here's a tip for you, and I didn't get to, you know, really show it off. I mean, I used it a bunch. I didn't get to talk about it, but if you are uh, using groups of units, um, and and let's see if I have. Oh, it's not going to let me do that. Okay, but if you're using groups of units that have that that are I have two of them together, um, you can. Uh, mm, let's see. Hang on. There we go. Let's say I can. Can I select these two? No, it's not going to let me select them both. Okay, so if you had two groups of units, and let's say I want to set them up to defend these two points. I have the group selected. I hit tab, which will select the first group. I click here. Then I hit tab again to select the second unit and click here. And now they're in two pieces of cover. Instead of just having all of them selected and clicking over here randomly, they might not show up in cover. They might both be in the same cover, which is very bad for grenades. So uh, use the tab to cycle through the units that you have currently selected to give them all groups. I use it a couple of times to quickly use a group and then say, okay, I've got a group of two units over here. I need to cap these two points. Tab, click, tab, click, done. And I'm gone. I don't have to go anywhere. I'm just over here. I'm doing something else. I don't have to select one on the screen and then tell him to go. I don't have to like select one down here. I just use the keyboard to make things faster. So uh, yeah, I hope that uh, this helped you guys. Uh, I think that's the only other thing I can think of. Uh, so uh, have a good game. Good time, good everybody, and hopefully I'll get this out sometime before the end of the week for you. All right, thanks, and bye. Another Training Tuesday is done.